good people and welcome back to our channel thank you so much for stopping by and checking out this video if today is your first time on this channel you are welcome we are happy we are so delighted to have you here welcome to joyton and i do hope you will enjoy your stay here today and we can never take your love for granted okay you are amazing and on this channel we'll be bringing you latest news and cheese and if you like to be family no problem just go ahead and click on that red button down below and turn on the bell for notifications so you'll be notified anytime we upload new videos and in this particular video i am going to be watching with you so with that being said let's get into the video we must go Buhari must go Buhari must go Yeah, so we, 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 we've been there every single night and the only reason we are, we're here is for him to go back home yeah, to Nigeria. He's yeah. killing students in Nigeria. He's here for medical checkup. There's not one single working hospital in the whole country of 200 million people. That he can visit. That he can visit. Except come and use our NHS, which I'm paying for. <laughs> <laughs> so there, there, there's plenty of footage of... Trying to get the guy who came yesterday. I was going to say, he's a more. There's so many. There's so many people. Exactly there's so many. While you're looking through that, all, all I can say is, is we've got, I haven't been at this one before, so I will, if you're telling me. He's perfectly fine. Days, that's, I've got no reason to disbelieve you. What I can say is, from my experience over many years of dealing with these things, not just 16 days, many years dealing with these things, I am aware. But embassies as a whole, not just the Nigerian embassies as a whole okay. in the UK, from any country at all, <coughs> I mean, <coughs> from, like, on the steps of their embassies, this is not right, a good sign. Would, would not be happy with it. Maybe saying, "Well, why is this being done? Are allowed to be done?" Yeah. yeah. This is us. How, um, you've been here for sixty days. Do you know how long you're going to? Be? As long as he leaves the country and goes back and do his job. So that's what we're asking for. What, what I want, well, hopefully, he said two weeks. He said two weeks, and he's, I mean, he's gone past it. that. Sorry. So, just trying to find. What I will do for continuity for you guys, because I know you guys don't cause us any issues. You come and you make the process, and you go. On. What I'll do is tonight, because of what you're telling me, and there seems to be a bit of not you know, a bit of disparity, a bit of what I'm telling you. I'll, tell you I'll put up the MC liaison and see through that a constant message comes out. This was yesterday when it came to the, because the door of the embassy. They took the alarm inside to get you guys out again twice last night. We did what the guys inside? Yeah. yeah. Is there any audio that's really saying that the posters are there okay or? They were just saying that, you know, where's the guy? That's what he did was he came in and knocked on the door and asked the end to start the conversation. Did he say he made it or did he say he made it? He knocked on the door and he, I'm trying to remember the sergeant's name. Uh, I should have taken note of the sergeant's name who came on the day. Well, we get a sergeant coming every night. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, I'm not 100% it was this sergeant, but it could well have been this sergeant. And it was the sergeant. And he did explain he, it. He, he drove the black van. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's easy to get to Yeah. yeah. And he did explain as to what the regulation was, very specific in what he was stating. And he stated that we're not allowed to fix anything to the door because of, for whatever reason. That's when he was just calling for the end of the stuff to come downstairs. These workers in this agency, in this embassy, is their all liars. Unbelievable liars. Sad, but then you don't. But they, they are not. I said, I'm not going to take any weeks off. But it's not going to be going to them, because yeah. they won't be saying the same thing about like you. What they, no, they won't. What they no, they won't. Saying, it is on record here, was that the officer had stated that they had said to him they had complained about problems. You're allowed to protest. That's, that's the thing that you have to manage the expectations yes, of them. Because, because in certain countries around the world, I'm sure you're aware of this, certain countries where they're less sick at, is yes. they, wouldn't, they wouldn't stand for anybody, even doing a peaceful process like this, or any good They won't have it. They want you. Tyranny. 
a mile away or whatever like this. And that's that's what that's what that's what I'm saying. This, but yeah. that's a lot of companies right. And it, it's us for a man manage embassies and expectations. Can we get your name? Yeah, the one in Sergeant Ferguson. So I'm sure the number is 241 um, on there, and that's how I'm known through the department. I'm, I'm sure because the person did take the organisation name, which is TID. And the CID. They've been coming every single night. And what does that say for? Take it back. Take it back. Take, take it, back. it back. Nigeria. And the action is revolution now. So what we do is we come, ever since the president has been in the country, I'm willing to, I'm willing to make the facilities in the job. That's what we're being told, then we'll leave it that for now and I'll try and get some clarity on it because it's not nice if you've been going on and two different messages which I completely appreciate. Thank you. That's why I'm not going to enforce the thing that's going on. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Buhari Moss. 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 Yes, we are back here. And once again, they called the police on us. Lying. Lying to the police. Nigerian government, you are full of lies. The lies continue to catch up with you. That's what happens to liars. You lose credibility. Nobody wants to hear you anymore. Stop lying on your citizens. Lie, lie. Stop lying on the basic things that you know is right. Say the truth. Do the right thing. That's what we're asking for. Go back home and fix your hospital back home. Go back home and pay the doctors back home. Don't come and spend Nigeria's money in a, in a UK hospital. You are a liar. A lying president. A lying government. We've had enough. Stop lying to the Nigerian people. Protest is allowed. People can come out and protest. Protest is allowed. Stop lying. Oh, Buhari must go! 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 Okay guys, so that'll be all from us today and we do hope to see you in our next one and if you have not subscribed and you like the channel go ahead and subscribe okay and turn on the bell for notification so you'll be notified anytime we upload new videos and if there's anything you would like us to know or any kind of suggestion you have for us feel free and drop it at the comment section and we will get back to you until next time bye for now